sent me. He was like, Danny forgot about the Iron Fleet. That's what he fucking justified. Yeah. Wow. Forgot. She somehow forgot that the biggest threat to her just didn't exist. Didn't, well, that's the thing is, it. like, all of these big uh, twists and stuff, it, it's it's a, it's about subverting expectations. Yeah. They're turning into M. Night Shyamalan. Like, to subvert expectations, they gotta turn people into idiots. Yeah. Yes. That's what Dan, Dan said that. He was like, in order to do this, they have to turn every single character into a moron. Yeah, yeah. And have them completely act out of character so that they can have some surprise. Yeah. Which, honestly, Game of Thrones, the books, was never built off of twists. Most no. of the time, it's actually not twists. It's, like, heavily read between the lines. And yeah. you get a feeling of what they're going to do before they do it. Well, we, were, we were watching that thing. Uh, Even, like, the movie. Red Wedding, it kind of came out of nowhere. But reading the chapter up to it, I was like, dude, something is really wrong here. Yeah, like it was like everything saying. felt wrong about it. you know shit yeah. like that. Which and if was you're watching in the show, one of the they're bigger to moments, that a little bit more and just make it a little more eerie and like well, that was the, the music the... in the background was a little off. They played right into like the were... surprises were the equivalent of like like the mountain and the viper and how that fight turned out. Right. Like it was like yeah. that. It wasn't. Oh, we're just gonna like all of a sudden be like, oh, Iron Fleet. Ghost is really a dragon. Yeah. <laughs> Take eight months of character development and just be like, oh, we did something different because we subverted your expectations. Because yeah. aren't you guys so impressed? Like, no. Spoiler! <laughs> Sansa is the Night King. Yeah. <laughs> well, Bet you didn't see that coming. I hope the they interviews... bring us back in this last episode. Especially it's supposed to be a big fight this This is this, this is the biggest... The, uh, Amelia Clark said this is an even bigger fight. Like, maybe not by numbers, but yeah. by sheer yes. production. Well, probably by deaths. So, I'm going to just... Oh, wait. I'm going to make sure it. that my thing is actually... It's, it's okay, guys. I'm, I'm just going to enjoy it for what it is, which is Same. junk food. Different. I mean, I'll, <laughs> yeah. I'll still enjoy it, but I'm going logically, enjoy it. it doesn't I'm just gonna make try, any sense. I'm just going to try not to think. At least I'm on camera little. and on the talks after. One of the things I like... I'm going to the, try to not rip it to shreds. George R. R. Martin was like, he, you know, just because some people figure out the ending doesn't mean you go and you change it so that... They yes. Surprised. That doesn't mean you change the ending that makes sense. Like right. He's like, it's gonna stay the same no matter if people. Have, and I think he said people have figured it out already, like how the story ends and stuff like that. And he's like, and that's okay it. as long as it makes sense within the universe that you've created. <laughs> right. And he said that a lot of these characters, like, there's bullet points of things they have to hit, but the journey of how they get there is gonna be different in the books <laughs> than it is on screen. Yeah, they're doing because it'll actually make sense. Yeah. Well, that's why. <laughs> that's true. And I'm like, okay, you better hurry up and write these books before you die. Seriously. <laughs> if anything, I just want to go back and reread all the books now way more. No, you should. I've read the first one. I haven't read. Yeah, yet. actually, after after episode three, I started reading. The you books you were like, I can't do this. Anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I tried, you're, like, yeah. you're like, dear God. Dude. What the hell is going on with my Chromecast? I don't know. It was working earlier. Dude, it's like. Basically, the show has now, it wasn't before, become the equivalent of what the Harry Potter films were to the books. Mm. Just like summaries. They that, started out really good. Just some, yeah, just like summaries that like completely remove certain things that made things make sense. Like the whole backstory of Voldemort? Yeah. Yeah. Shit like that. Like explaining you know like like the backstory behind the marauders and how that played into Sirius black mm-hmm. they're just like we don't have time for all that so here's Sirius black, black. Yeah, here's cool. Sirius black. <laughs> the end. this is him he, uh, he's an uncle we're not gonna out. really explain to you why everyone believed he did it mm-hmm. because it made perfect logical mm-hmm. sense why they believed it and it also makes perfect sense why he knew exactly who did do it mm. instead of yeah because yeah, they literally just I think they had one scene of him in Azkaban or something mm-hmm. like that and then yeah. him escaping mm-hmm. that was it and then he was a teacher or something uh, they never actually officially stated that uh, Lupin was one of the martyrs no? in the no. movies? no they never com- really? they, they never actually identified him as Mooney Interesting. I haven't seen the movies in a while. Neither have I. <laughs> you didn't even see them. I haven't even finished the movies. Did you read all the books? I read the first no, two books. He did not. <laughs> I, I saw the I saw the first five movies and I read the first two books. Brian has a legit 
reason for why he doesn't like Harry Potter that I accept. Yeah. I accept. Because I, I just like magic in more of a traditional fantasy sense where magic is more of a, a necessity rather than a... Um, Convenience. Uh, convenience, yeah. Uh, that makes sense. Because, okay. like, the the magic in Harry Potter is just like, oh, I can travel better. Like, yeah, I see what it's you're not, saying. like, necessary for survival. Yeah, it's not like that's <laughs> what defines them. That makes sense. But when you got a fucking dragon, yeah. you need some, well, I guess you just need a big ass ballista now. But <laughs> yeah, seriously. That can travel that, miles. Low key, kind of crazy how accurate. overpowered, how OP those fucking ballistas are. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, it went from like. Yeah. I have to think, guys. You guys are thinking. You guys are thinking. Don't do that. Don't just do watch that. Enjoy. We also watched watch a guy forward. who analyzed medieval. Uh, oh, battle. medieval battle, and just just like the the Battle of Winterfell was the worst didn't make tactics sense ever. ever. Oh, I, I, I'd say I found a video where that. a guy said the same thing I did, where I was like. Why didn't they have the Dothraki flank them? That's yeah. exactly what this other guy said. Is that what he said? said? Yeah. yeah. I, like, I, I, I rewrote like, that episode myself, myself, actually. He's like, why are the catapults really in front of the troops? Yeah, the, the trebuchets were in front of the, oh my the God, ground so troops. they would get taken anyways. Yeah. Like, that's so stupid. And and the Dothraki, forget about the fact that they charged. They didn't know Melisandre was coming. Yeah. They didn't have Dragonglass. They didn't have Valyrian they Steel. Had, they just had they, You literally had your, like, it made, sending them to It made sense sky. for them to be in front of the castle. But they failed to explain why it made sense. Because the White Walkers would have been able to topple over the walls like they did within minutes. Because it's such a disposable army and they yeah. don't care about how many people they're losing. They're just like, so, stack bodies until we can get over the top. All they gotta do is get over the top and it's game over. So it makes sense for them to be like, okay, somebody's going to need to actually keep them off the wall itself. Yeah, so, put them in front. so, but you wouldn't have them charge at an Straight army off. of fucking 100,000 yeah. people. Now what you do the is side. they come from the sides. Yeah. They would flank them, and then you'd have the dragons blasting in, in the middle. Yeah. yeah. All right, let's get this started. Okay. <laughs> we can talk about that what am I? forever. What am I? Just the general. <laughs> Just the <a> lowly general. <laughs> what the fuck do I know, right? Hey guys, welcome back to Boardwatch. I'm Brian. Jessica. Justin. Joey. And we are here for Season 8, Episode 5, getting ready for a big old battle. Um, mm -hmm. So, uh, there was one question from the comments go leading into this episode, if there was any specific fights that you wanted to see. Uh, like Game Bowl. Like, like Clegane yes. Bowl. Um, there's really not too many people on the other side. Is there anyone that you want to specifically see fight a uh, Euron? Uh, yeah. I mean, now that Theon's gone, it's kind of the the skin in the game would would only yeah. be Yara, mm -hmm. but right. Yara isn't there she's as far there. as you know. Maybe right. she'll come. I um, want to see Jamie kill cool Cersei. Her own yeah, life. like we want Jamie to kill Cersei. The books and the Valonqar make it so that either Jamie or Tyrion should kill Cersei. But <laughs> honestly, at this point, <laughs> like I'm kind of in for Jamie and Brienne fighting it to death. <laughs> oh man! Screw it. it! Just fuck screw it! it. <laughs> like, fuck at screw this, it! At this point, screw it! At uh, this point, point like, screw it! Let it, them. They'll, fight. they'll probably just be like, "Oh, Arya killed Cersei because she kills everyone." Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, I hope arrow not. to the. Arrow she, to the head she's Lady Stoneheart. The she's window. the prince who was promised, and she's the Queen Slayer. Just fuck just, it. That, that would be very disappointing. <laughs> honestly, honestly. Uh, I'm trying to think what it would be. A, I mean, yeah, like they, they kind of. Kids hold themselves because there's no one really left on Cersei's side. Yeah, maybe a battle with Bronn and the the Lannisters. Oh yeah, someone could someone could fight Bronn. Unlikely. I don't I think. Bron, I don't think he's. I don't. I don't think Bron, Bronn's staying out. I don't want to see anybody won. fight Bronn. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, Bronn's Bronn's staying out of this battle. Yeah. Like now, who do you think's gonna die? Because apparently, according to some of the cast members, like Amelia Clark said, there's gonna be more death in this episode than uh, I in Arya episode. Might I think Arya Pod. might die. Pod. Pod. Like, to subvert expectations, you know, a lot of people think Cersei... I'm gonna Cersei say Grey Worm's gonna live, because I've been pegging him to be dead for the past several episodes, and he's just survived. A lot of people are so. figuring Arya's gonna kill Cersei, and, but, like, what if she gets killed by, like, the mountain before and she's able to kill Cersei? Makes the game I don't happen. think the mountain is going to kill Arya. I think the mountain might chop her in half. I don't that think he will. Like he did the horse? Yeah. Oh, um, just chop the horse's head off. Hmm. The head I think the hound will protect her. If Pot is there, because I don't know if Pot is actually there. The thing is, shouldn't Arya and the Hound get there before the rest of the army? Because they yes. left before everyone yeah. else. Yes. Yeah. They should already be there. Yeah. If I, that might even be where they open I'm up. I'm guessing the they're already there. Yeah. 
Um, there are people. There are people that are like a lot of people. This past week have been talking about extra dragons because of Drogon being gone for like all of season five was it or four? Oh, they uh, thought he was getting busy. Yeah, With well, what? Ch- no, changing into a girl and laying eggs and then changing back to a guy or something. Um, I don't know uh, about that. They, I thought they would. Life runs that. away. <laughs> no, no, <laughs> Jeff, Dra- Goldblum, no, 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 Jeff is, Goldblum said Dra- that. Jeff Goldblum. Dragons. Jeff Goldblum <laughs> says that. Je- dragons are gender fluid in the universe. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Like, but just like dinosaurs. That's what I said. Life finds a way. So you might even lose. Joe at this point, Joe might fuck it. <laughs> at this point, <laughs> fuck it. Yeah, we might lose all the dragons. That's kind yeah. of the point we're at right now. At this point, fuck army of dragons. Don't really point, know dude, what you expect. Bring like Pegasus into this. Yeah, <laughs> dude. Can we get a noggin. Dude, get a noggin. Let's get a noggin now. now. Can we get a noggin now? Like you guys. Is that now. a real creature? Yes. Well, no, not like not, not like, in the real no, world. It's a mythical creature. But <laughs> it like, is a mythical. Creature. It is a mythical creature okay. within the within the realm of yeah Game of Thrones. Yeah. But like, in Game of Thrones, so were, was a fucking giant like, until we saw that on screen. So I just want to make sure we're giants, all so giants, giants White used Walkers. to be mythical. Yeah, White Walkers used to be mythical. Dragons used to Nagas be mythical. Nagas used to be too, but they don't have a CGI budget, so fuck them. <laughs> <laughs> fuck them. We deserve a Naga after all that. Uh, all, right, all, work, right, all right, all right, all right. But back on track. Uh, de- uh, top three deaths. Since we did this for episode three, top three deaths for this one. Let's start over there. I don't think of it. Yeah. I don't know. Okay. Arya, Drogon. The Hound. Oh, like, of the, the... Oh, yeah. Mountain's in there, too, but, but those are the... Pod, the if he's thing. there. If he's there, which is... I don't know if he actually is, because mm. he's Brienne's squire, and Brienne didn't go. Um, I'm gonna go... Sir Davos Seaworth. Mm. Yeah, like, that that I would like, be a kick in the uh, dick, I man. Like, I like that. That'll be a kick in the, <laughs> in the, be a kick in the <laughs> dick, yeah. That'll hurt, that'll hurt That'll hurt me. And I'm gonna go with the hound. Any of the bad guys? Oh, the mountain. Never mind. Swap the hound. The, the, but they're both gonna die, I think. So yeah, the mountain and the hound. But we'll go more likely you don't, you the don't mountain. Do you think Huron's die in this episode? No. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, I'm gonna say Huron's gonna die. Yeah. I could see that happening. Yeah. And Arya, Huron. Who will get him? Not sure. And. I don't know who else. I want to say Cersei, just but I don't think she's gonna die. She, she's dying one of these two episodes. Maybe. Yeah, I maybe, don't, maybe. I don't know that. This Subvert is expectations. Time. She's on the iron throne the end. <laughs> but uh, at this point, fuck that would be the whack. So, so my guess <laughs> is she bits pizza everybody. You're on. <laughs> Do you think Grey Worm survives after Masande? I think, yeah. After this point, they they could have killed him so many times. There's no way they're gonna kill all the black people in this show. They're gonna leave at least one. They've already killed fifty yeah. <laughs> percent. <laughs> so uh, <laughs> excommunicated the rest that are alive. Yeah, they're just not on the show. Do you think Yara will be a part of this battle? <laughs> Maybe. Uh, possibly. I wouldn't if I was her. I'd start um, fucking. But again, she took the whole point of her taking the Iron Islands, according to them, was to to have a place to retreat to. Right. So. Okay. So yeah, I'm, my guesses are Euron. Um, I'm still thinking they're gonna kill Grey Worm. Uh, I'll, I'll stick with that. And then uh, that would hurt me. And Grey Worm would suck. I was prepared for it two episodes ago. I it was didn't too. Happen. And, I was uh, too. And get, uh, <laughs> Gendry, Lord of Storms, end just dies. After being Lord, after getting Dang. broken up and with... No, no, they won't kill him. They're, 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 all the shippers, shit, he's going to be with Arya because... No, she's going to die. That's what fans want. She's going to die. Uh, I don't know. So, yeah, I'm... I'm oh, okay, okay, Pod. Pod instead of Gendry. So, <laughs> you, you're, you're on Grey Worm and Pod. Pod is a dead man walking. I can't believe he survived the Battle of Winterfell. Same. That's true. That's yeah. a real test. All right. Uh, <laughs> so yeah, uh, we sure. really want to watch this now. So, <laughs> all right, or Navies. Yeah. Oh! Oh! Fuck! What? Varys is dying. Oh, Varys? Yeah, Varys. Oh, maybe. Varys is dying because or I'm co-sign that. because Melisandre uh, said that both of them would die on this continent. I bet you uh. Daenerys kills them. And Melisandre's prophecies are the she only will prophecies that matter be at this point. Yeah. You, know, you know bald nigga already seen so, her. She'll find out. Tyrion might even tell her. True heir to the pop. Rhaegar Targaryen. Yeah. Oh, oh snap. Shit. You should have called that earlier. Yeah. Yeah. I should, I should have called Varys dying earlier. 
I have known more kings and queens than any man living. I've heard what they say to crowds and seen what they do in the shadows. I have furthered their designs, however horrible. But what I tell you now is true. You will rule wisely and well while she... She is my queen. We'll see. Oh, he's not going to send a letter. He's still about to get fucking killed, though. What's he going to do? Oh, he knows he's about to get killed. It was me. I hope I deserve this. Truly, I do. I hope I'm wrong. Really? He called bears right before he like fuck oh, bears. Yeah. <laughs> like during the during the intro, I'm just like, wait, bears! If the city surrenders, they will ring the bells and raise the gates. Please, if you hear them ringing the bells, call off the attack. I've always hated the bells. They ring for horror. A dead king, a city under siege. A wedding? Exactly. Is that welcoming the new king? I've never known bells to mean surrender. They should attack at night. Well, just Drogon should attack at night. Just Drogon. Yeah. To take out all the ballistas. Yeah. But Just on the outside. Hey, what strategy? That's if you're being smart. What strategy? Let's just attack anyways, because I'm yeah. not right now. We'll just kill everybody. You were the only one. We didn't treat me like a monster. Mm -hmm. You were all I had. Your Grace, the Iron Fleet is burning. <laughs> the gates have been breached. The, the Golden Company. Our men will fight harder than Sellswords ever could. John and Baywar side by side. I know, and Davos. And Davos. Oh, and Davos. Oh, that I didn't see, see Davos. I didn't see him. It'd be almost foolish of her to burn all those people inside of the keep. Now, nah, after she already defeated them. She only cares about herself. Don't do it, Daenerys. It's not even necessary. No, why would you? If she does this. It doesn't make any sense. Why would she? Why would she kill that? Yeah. Nice. Well, seriously, had way too much faith in her men. And then Daenerys is going to burn them anyway. Yeah, I know, right? Imagine. Jokaris. I'm like, really? Or Cersei. Like I said, she might have some wildfire up her sleeve. I don't know. I thought she blew it all up last time. Her crazy ass about to go burn the keep of me and the bells are sending her into a flurry right now. Yeah. Because she's mad it's almost like taking away her victory. Oh my god! Oh my god! She's crazy! Oh my god! She's crazy! Yo, yo. If this, anybody saw her fan, you're bugging. You're bugging, you're bugging. There's no reason for that. You're killing at all. everybody so, for no reason. For literally those, no those reason. Those bells literally are just like, you won. Yeah. And she's like, I don't even give a shit about it. I thought at least she was going straight. She's burning houses. She's not even burning the Red Keep. 
I know. She's just killing innocents now. Are, are the Unsullied gonna too? Oh my god! They fucking surrounded. Oh my god! Sounds like Wells. Yeah, jo Johnny cool that. No, I don't. I think this is a turning point for him. He's like, I it can't should be. She's her. fucking crazy. This is I've been screaming this for a minute. This is ridiculous. They didn't even build it up well. Why? No, but it's not even. They didn't even make it understandable from her character development for why she would have done that. That was literally just pure selfishness. For no reason, and they I thought she did. They wouldn't even. I thought she was no at reason. least going to just go for the red key right? and that fuck Cersei. She's now burning She's innocent burning kids for no reason. That's Crazy. the Daenerys that you've grown to. This is your queen? Right. This is your queen? Not burning not burning innocent Look people at this. This as even, part of the battle. This isn't even by the red key. A battle that's, point. yeah. This is the bells were rung. She doesn't even give a shit. Burn everyone. Tyrion's like, oh my fuck god. This. Fuck Should've listened to this Varys. Is so fucking crazy. She's so fucking insane. Man, I've been screaming this bitch is crazy. There's absolutely no reason for this. She's not crazy. I understand everything she's done. Under me. These dumbass just, people are just gonna be like, oh well, they ruined her character. She would have never done that. Either fucking way. I, I'm, on that, yeah. right. I mean, I'm I, on that side of the Yeah. I mean, I'm on that side of the I don't journey. believe she would have done this. She yeah. is not this crazy. You don't just t trigger to this. So now everyone's gonna end. John's gonna kill her. Obviously. He has to, he has to kill her now. All right. Everybody defended her. She was always no. She was always a little crazy. This is something. No, this is insane. But I'm this still is saying. This is not. Uh, this is not. I'm just saying. Going along with this show. You know, King. Oh, but I am. And I fucked the queen. He's on time with his baby. Mm -hmm. If I win, I'll bring you ahead to Cersei so you can kiss her. One last time. <laughs> what logical reason does your own have for fighting him right now? Right. Yeah, nothing. Maybe it's because he finally figured out about the baby? No. He didn't even say that. He, he would run. He He's would run. It's his. his Iron Fleet is destroyed. Yeah. He's so second on the most wanted list of dead people. He knows he just said the city's burning. There's no salvation. So I'm going to stop and be like, no, let's fight first. Fight for Cersei. This. Oh my god. He killed Jamie. <laughs> That's how Jamie dies? His fucking year old? But he may not be dead yet. Oh. You're right, there is wildfire. I don't understand why you're on the stop, though. <laughs> Fighting every block. on the ground. Yeah, for block. I'm it. trying not to block. I don't know about that. You see? There we go. Sandal. Thank you. Yeah, the game ball. Sir Gregor, I command you. Obey your queen, Sir Gregor. <laughs> oh shit. Ha ha ha, bye oh, Kyler. Shit. Get his ass.
It's in their blood. John ran straight at Ramsey. <laughs> She can't control the zone, right? I mean, they, in all they, fairness, they are, this is the green light. They've been waiting for it. They're like, right. hey, they are right. rapers and pillagers. We're back to yeah. we're back to pillaging. Yeah. They're like, it's all guys. This is not a drill. They're, yeah, and they like this is not a drill. <laughs> this is not a drill. This is not a drill. Let's like catch that, them. That's the most like, realistic part of this episode. So yeah. I, Not by the little brother, but by rocks. Technically, you let her down there. That's true. How did that horse not get burned? Bloody. Bran warped into it yeah. and brought the horse there. <laughs> Bloody white horse showing her innocence. Nah, lost. dude, she's good. Daenerys is gonna go into the into the red keep and just uh, see Bran sitting on there. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> It's built into the real backs it up. <laughs> That'd be awesome. And then just gonna say the things we do for love, <laughs> with, <laughs> with no context. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just right off into the sunset. Nice. You know what I like is that they don't take shortcuts. <laughs> they build up reasons for exits and entries and deaths. No I day. think the plot is what I appreciate most of this last <laughs> season. No I day is like I I, you know what I really think they nailed? The characters' logics. Yeah. Like, like, so sound. Oh that's how it ends? Like, everything that's happened That's how that episode ends? <laughs> it just gets up and leaves. Everything that's happened with the characters <sighs> made... <sighs> You, oh the thing I think gosh. literally made the most sense was you're on Greyjoy just deciding to have a one-on-one. -on -one <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's so like, like count like, the seeds listen, still alive. I can tell you if like oh my, my army was just obliterated oh. and I would be like, yeah, all right, Joey, it's about that time yeah. we settle this. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you gotta take it well, away. fuck it then. At least I'm gonna take Joey belt. for no reason with me. <laughs> Guess what? I fuck Cersei. That's what He's he like, wanted to I'm say. So bad. Guess That's what, Joey? Chest? I fucked your girl. Yeah. Fight me. Fight me. And then he's like, I killed him. He didn't even kill him. Oh. He didn't even kill him. <laughs> what did he say that for? I know, right? I'm the one who Why would he have said that? <laughs> Why would the writers have said that? Can I ask him? <laughs> I'm going to take this opportunity. You fans I forgot are powerful. about that. Can I ask the I writer personally who wrote this episode why you thought I'm the one who killed the <laughs> Slayer? I thought like Jane that, man. I was like, oh, he's going to he's gonna die. You know, like as a result of his wounds, this isn't even how he died. I think whoever called for Cersei being killed by a bunch of rocks tumbling on her in the hands of Jamie to win a million dollars, they deserve that. Whoever predicted Dude, whoever that Whoever put there, that on Vegas... Vegas odds are going one in the a million. The Vegas odds are right like, really? Pile of rocks. Pile of rocks. Pile of rocks. <laughs> I, love, I love they teased the window. They teased the fucking out. When she I thought like, she was going to jump. I was like, like jump, 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 jump. I would have jump, prayed jump. for that. I would have prayed for that. And she's like, oh, my scared. God. I'm like, no. She's like, like, Tom, and I'm coming. <laughs> the most fearless bitch in this whole show so far is like, no, take me to the keep so we can get protected. Like, I will never be taken. Okay, I guess I got taken. Like, Without even hesitation, she left. With a with a hand grab, she gets taken away. The logic, no, no, no. The logic will be, um, well, she wants to protect her kid. Yes, but she didn't want to protect her kid and surrender the city when it was clear <laughs> that this yeah. was over. Yeah. So, she didn't. Then. Uh, George, uh, oh. if you calling it now, Arya will kill Danny. Yeah. yeah, I hope so. This uh, programmer video games. So hard to for launch. Well, rip Game of Thrones. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. <laughs> seriously. It's been uh, nice. Edward Longshanks, uh, Hammer of Scots, Lord of Wales, and King of England. So, Danny and Jamie just forgot who their characters are. Okay. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I think the jokes are going to be what's best about the Programmer of video games. There were leaks about episode six. Uh, won't spoil it, but it might as well be true at this point. <laughs> Uh, yeah. So yeah, no, I haven't looked into. No, like movies. honestly, like I don't want it spoiled because I'm like, dude, I want to laugh at just yeah. how bad this finale is gonna <laughs> this be. Is it's into the best comedic show. It's dude. It's, it's like, turning on, into pure comedy. Oh man, it's yeah. Uh, Fuck you. 
I want to send a big <laughs> fuck you out to all the writers out there who yeah. are just trying no, to mess. No, dude, I laughed Jordan. really hard. It, it was entertaining. Yeah, you know, like, if nothing uh, else, it was entertaining. The, to the last right away, to the last. Hold on, let's start positive. Clean inter- game inter- bowl. Inter- <laughs> we got the clean game bowl. We got it. Yeah, we did. Yeah, I didn't we even did. like how that ended. No, I'm pretty. It ended that with a tackle. Yeah, clean game bowl. Just oh into God. fire. Yeah, like this is what everybody's wanted. It's clean game bowl. There is, I agree. There is no logic to this whatsoever. <laughs> oh my God. Well. Hey, there's uh, only one more episode left, guys. <laughs> I Dear don't know what God, to say. I don't even know what to say. To what do point. we say to the God of Logic? <laughs> Not today. <laughs> so true. Oh my so true. That should be a meme. Uh, but they, they're probably going to pat that. Like, if we watch this after special, they're probably going to pat themselves on the back, being like, well, everyone probably thought Arya was going to kill her, and we subverted expectations yeah. by making a pile of rocks kill her. <laughs> they're going to they're gonna be like, I don't know if you saw the cinematography. Oh, oh my god. god. Dude, that was legendarily bad. <laughs> I think they're trying to, at this point, outdo their previously worst episode. I'm more just. Last episode, was, last episode was the was worst episode that they ever made. I'll say this. Until yeah. this episode. Arya killing the Night King is less disappointing and the way in the episode it happened in is, la- is way less disappointing than this whole episode right now. Agreed. And I was furious that it happened that early and the way it did. Not that she killed him, but the way it did. And then this episode was like, yeah, that wasn't even that bad. I honestly forgot that I hated the Arya Night King because they, they're setting whole new things. Oh my god, they're like, oh really? I'm like, oh, oh, you, oh, you thought that was bad? Yeah. Wait till you see episode six. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, this uh, is so fucking bad. Is Arya immune to fire now? Right? So yeah. expectations. Arya is also immune to falling rocks and Dothraki blades. <laughs> yeah. I'm so jealous that you guys can laugh. I am so depressed and sad and angry right now. That it's a I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm like compartmentalizing. At least the first thing. We laugh to cover the tears. Yeah. <laughs> we laugh to cover the tears. My chest is tight. These are not laughs of joy. These are tight. laughs of great pain. Oh my god, I am so hard reading. Right, I'm dude. reading the book so hard now. Oh, Alright, oh, dude. This is yeah. What was everybody's the through the roof. favorite shit moment? <laughs> <laughs> Let's pick our favorite shitty moments. <laughs> you know mine. Mine's your oh, for sure. I was like, whoa. Why? Oh, um, I so think many. mine's going to be Jamie and Cersei just having a bunch of rocks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think that's tied. I think that's tied with Daenerys burning random city people <laughs> instead of going to the Red Keep where she right, knows she's like, What at. is she doing? Honestly, that's more true to character than Euron not yeah. dipping. Yeah. You're that, right. that didn't out make of, any sense. Out of the waves, <laughs> let's fight Jamie Lannister. <laughs> Fuck you, Jamie. What? So, so someone's like, they should have had Drogon leap out of the sea over the Iron Fleet so we could start talking about shows jumping the dragon rather than jumping the <laughs> Uh, that's a good one. I like yeah. that. Um, and for the record, the actors in production department are masters at their craft. Only masters could uh, bring Dumb and Dumber's mediocrity to life. That's yeah. true. <laughs> Seriously. You know, yeah. like, yeah, production value, <coughs> again. Is great. It, it, spot, it, it was, spot on. It was spot You know, it's like, it's like when you watch your friends like shitty short film, you're like, dude, the lighting was like really good. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Dude. Like, what'd you think? Um, I love Loved. Did you guys the see costumes. those cutaways? Did you guys see those I transitions? I loved the yeah. costumes. Those transitions per scene. I honestly liked when like the fire took up the whole scene and you thought Arya got burned and then it cut to uh, the rocks. To Jamie. Oh yeah, yeah. I really yeah. liked that cut. <laughs> so shout out to the editor, programmer of video games. You know what could have made this trashy season better if they end Game of Thrones with a cameo from the Man in Black from Westworld, and, <laughs> and it turns out to be another theme park. <laughs> <laughs> you, know, you know what they should do is put George R's face on Daenerys' face. I want to see George R's reaction to he's, this. No, he's Daenerys in the fucking throne room after Masande died by herself. Like, who did this? Oh my God. The writers. I know it was the writers. Dan and Dave have confirmed uh, that when the finale airs, they will be drinking and having their phones turned off. Hope that the ceiling crumbles on them. <laughs> Poetic justice. Seriously. Man. Uh, uh, uh at the beginning of se- uh, of the season, Night King was the true villain. Episode four, nah, uh, Cersei is the villain. Episode five, nah, uh, Danny is the villain. Episode six, nah, uh, Thanos is the villain. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that, uh, I think we should just react to their uh, comments. Yeah, at, at this point, point uh, let's oh just God. react 
All right, guys, keep zinging them. Keep zinging them. You guys are bringing oh it tonight. God. They're coming correct. Oh, my God. This is the best writing we've seen all day. I'm yeah. happy we're all on the same page with this. So. Oh, my God. Do you think that there is any good in this episode? The cinematographics were amazing. The fire scenes were amazing. Uh, I like that Grey Worm was going in. That kind of actually made a little yeah, that sense. Was cool. Yeah. Varys at the beginning? Made, yeah. made, made sense. Yeah. Made sense. Yeah. But... It made a lot more sense with uh, with Daenerys burning him rather than all freaking. I was a little disappointed. Yeah, yeah. Here's yeah, yeah. I will honestly say I didn't that. lose all. I was yet, disappointed so then... that they didn't call back to what she said to him. That's why I knew he died when she said. I was like, oh no, she's no, 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 no. No, Sandra said that they were gonna. Die. No, 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 not that. I don't know what she the scheming when she told oh. Barris like, if their day comes when um, I'm disappointing you, come to me first instead of scheming. Yeah, and then so that's why I knew he was gonna die. I, I thought like, they kind of made a call back to that last episode, though. He said, "I would say, I would say it to your face." And but he did it. No, like, yeah, no. You, as he was pleading for her to not burn King's Landing, he kind of talked to her a little bit. He didn't oh, call back that exact reference. I see what you're saying. But he's, he's just, just like, like yeah, I, I, I may, that, yeah, I, I was expecting I if, if he was gonna do that, I was expecting him to honor his word. That's because Varys is a man of honor. To honor his word, say it to her face first, and be like, "You're doing the kind of shit that makes me think about scheming again." Yeah, yeah. yeah. I was a little disappointed. Start tripping, make you cheat. Yeah. Make you cheat. <laughs> you're, you're fucking up you're right doing, now. You're doing, the thing. <laughs> you're doing that shit. You're that doing, doing the thing. The good scene. You start writing that letters to your host. The like, good scene was the mountain killing Kyburn. Yeah, that was pretty cool. Yeah, that was kind of cool. He's like, ah, oh, okay, and, and suddenly about. Stannis doesn't look so bad that anymore. Kind of, but no, 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 no. <laughs> that even kind of pissed me off. You're telling me the anger somehow inside for his brother, who he just hates so much. Erases all of his loyalty that he's had to these two people the entire time he's been under the, the person spell. that brought him back to life. Yeah, he's kind of crazy. Um, that's supposed to be the laziest writing ever. Like, no, it's not. Oh, oh no, on. have you watched this show? No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> that's up there. I don't think it is. Honestly, <laughs> that's that's of bad. this season, that's more sound than most oh, other things man. happening. Yeah, I'm like, so sure, sad. his hatred resurrected his mind. Oh my god. I don't know, man. I don't know. No, it's the Lord of Light. The Who's guy the we Lord know so much about. He's the Lord of Light who no, has mysteriously I'm trying to think of their yeah. justification for this. Maybe it's because Danny knew that she wasn't going to be able to get anything because she knew everyone's going to turn to Jon Snow's side. So she's like, fuck it. If, he, if I can't have it, no one can. But that's mad. Cause that's true. I did have an ex girlfriend say, you know, if I can't have Justin, no one <laughs> attempted to light me on fire. She gave him her Like, I, I think sure. that's like their. You got the what I'm they sure were. Joey's had a few of those. I'm sure Joey's had a few girls <laughs> try to light him on fire to sacrifice him. Everybody's betraying me. I don't know. Yeah. I, yeah, I'm trying to get inside the writer's head, but like I don't want to. I don't think they die. have. I mean, I I'll say they this: they, I always felt that she she very much had a little bit of the madness in her, but it was never burning innocent children. Right? Never. I I am sorry. I don't she, buy. She that. did hang innocent masters. No, not not to say that masters owning slaves is a good thing. But she but didn't like, do. She didn't know she cru- do that. She crucified. Well, she crucified. She crucified every every, every master. Every master. Even though not all masters, she were made a mistake. With that. Though, yeah. but she admitted she, she made she a mistake. Didn't learn from it though. But to to go from that, she's burnt. To go from the girl who stopped, who stood at yeah. the Dothraki and stopped them from raping girls, yeah. to now all of a sudden, in a fit of rage, instead of going at the person that she caused her so much pain, yeah, she decides, that, um, oh, I'm gonna kill all these twelve. Burn innocents. <laughs> Burn right? I'm not even buying that. I'm not sorry. Not There's, no There's no line of logic. Fuck D and D. There's no line of logic where that makes D&D sense D&D. in anything I, that we have seen. They set up that she's a little crazy. Sure, they set up that she kind of gets off to killing people. Sure, doing that. Absolutely not. I would not say yielding it's more that. I will not yield that. If there was a ring of circle of of, of mm-hmm. innocence and she had to burn them just to get to her, I would like. That's, That's what I thought might pull. happen. There's yeah. a yes. little more pull. She wasn't even close there was no to reason. the Red Keep. No. Was no, there she was, was no burning reason. Yeah. way I thought, in the Red Keep. Yeah. I thought yeah, in the innocence... Was, yeah, the innocence that she was ki- going to kill was going to be in the Red Keep. In the, in the middle of the yeah. fight. Like, yeah. in the middle of the fight up. when there was a reason for her to actually be attacking it. And it was like, oh, Drogon just kind of doesn't recognize things. I thought, like, she went straight at the, like, she's like, 12-year-old girl, you get it. Yeah. <laughs> Brett, Brett. Oh, baby. <laughs> Bran is just dreaming of all of this during the long night. Yeah, seriously. That'd be cool. I would appreciate that. <laughs> They're like, none of this that's bad writing happened. That's this what he was what could have happened. About. But what happened is that 
White Walkers kill everyone. <laughs> or no, maybe they'll do like Twilight and then like it'll just be Bran shaking Daenerys' hand and he's like, and that's what's going to happen if you don't listen to me. Yeah. <laughs> Have you ever seen the way Twilight ends? No, no, oh, it's, it's legendary. Really? bad like this. They like oh, do a whole man. battle sequence and then like all of a sudden you find out that it's just like a vision that one character is showing one person wow. and then his army just walks away. Wow. Or, 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 wow. how about this? We're, the, the entire show is actually 8,000 years in the past. The Three-Eyed Raven has jumped into the future and being like, Oh my God! If we let the white, if we beat the White Walkers right now, then uh, all of this bad shit's gonna happen. Fuck it! Just let the White Walkers kill us eight thousand years in the past. Oh my God! <laughs> like I don't know. It's just the three-eyed raven just times. I'm like, well, we have to let the White Walkers win. We have to let the White Walkers win. <laughs> oh my God! Wow. What are the comments do we got? Um, I enjoyed Varys's scene when Drogon appeared it, uh, it off the shadows above Danny. It was. Scary. I mean, yeah, That's like, cool we're, again, cool we're shot. not shitting on the directors. The photography was great. No, the directors, Just the writers. Did, the directors probably did the best. I, 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 the I, I like that for think the most part. Think about the script and reading that as a director and being like, for real? Like, this is. I think about being a director in any of the episodes of this entire series and you get this one and you're <laughs> like, are you serious? I'm off even John being right for the throne. The fact that he sat there and, and let her burn Varys without yeah. saying a thing because he should have said, he should have said, like, the old way of like, no, like, you're not just going to burn everything. Like, yeah. he said nothing to her, and he's had opportunities, and yeah. he said nothing. Yeah. They're building that up for him to, like, Props have to Well, I think from... now there's no way. Well, sure. But, like, to, to me, that makes John wrong for the throne, too. Yeah. No, that's true. I agree. I don't know why everybody's so high on him being for the throne. What if Sansa gets the throne? Sansa uh, seems like the best candidate, yeah, to be completely honest with you Obviously, at this point. I'd say if I had to pick one, I'd If pick I had to pick one, I'd be like, sure, Sansa. Yeah. Or like, yeah. I don't know, maybe yeah. maybe Pop. <clears throat> yeah, props Pop. to props to Varys Where? though. He knew when shit was gonna hit the fan and jumped off the ship. Shout True. out to Pompey for the location. <laughs> <laughs> nice. That's a good one. Well, That's a good one. I love that there are people picking on those tiny isolated incidents of misguided justice and trying to justify the, this wholesale slaughter with it. They are so blind; it's beyond belief. Uh, maybe Bran will finally play a part in this. Yeah. He should have already. How are there suddenly a few hundred Dothraki soldiers? They literally all died in episode three and yet are up in healthy fight. I thought they said something in episode four, like only half of them died or something bullshit they took, like that. I thought they took like three of the little triangles away and had one triangle. I thought it was like a third of their army yeah. or two thirds of their army. That got so I would argue there was more than a few hundred Dothraki. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that was a lot of them. There was a lot of them. I would say at least over a thousand. Yeah. So, see, this this is actually a comment that I think is right. If they had actually gone with ten seasons as HBO offered originally, mm -hmm. they could have fleshed out her madness fully yes. so yeah. that this moment yes. felt foreshadowed, set up, and earned. As it True. is, it comes out of nowhere. Yeah. yeah. True. Yeah, I always, especially season six, I was like, Why didn't they do that ten seasons? No story. They didn't want to. It. They're burnt out. And that's Because they have no more writing abilities. It, it, we, I agree. They're out. I, 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 you know what? I'm going gonna, gonna, to rant right now. I have been on the wall calling out the lazy writing for two seasons yeah. now. When I caught wind that they were saying, oh, we're not doing anymore, and they started shrinking it down, and I was like, dude, this is starting to feel like super condensed, and it feels like they're cutting corners they're here. Everything. Right. And they're rushing everything, and then now it's just getting worse. Like they're rushing, 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 and now we're getting to this big moment, and we're all sitting here like, we were what? laughing. We were laughing. Like you'll see the you'll see the reaction voice. when I when I edit it and post it, but like, <laughs> yeah. It's yeah. uh, it's what Game of Thrones has come to. Uh, it is you know, officially Game of Thrones and not uh, a song of ice and fire. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? I actually, mean? that that happened a long time ago. But it's like going to eat a chocolate chip cookie and it's oatmeal raisin. <laughs> <laughs> That's what or this like going to eat like. some M and M's and there's yeah, or in like there. it's like no because I like oatmeal water. raisin. <laughs> And I, I mean, I'd be disappointed, but I'd be like, okay, I like that. That's like going to eat a chocolate chip cookie and like you eat like, I don't even a know. Biscuit. Black licorice? Poop? Yeah, a piece of shit. <laughs> like, oh my God, this like, is a handful oh of shit. Oh my God, this is poop. John did, not, John did not pet the goodest boy last episode. He's dead to me. <laughs> Swear, they let a, a lingering look to what? A lingering seconds? look was supposed to be very, very more effective. No. Shame uh, on you, shame. I, you know what I want? I want the writers of this to get shamed like fucking Cersei <laughs> did. We hit in the fucking and walk through naked through all the fucking King's Landing for their horrible, horrible writing for the last two. Like, oh my god. While the dragon chases them. Tyrion and Arya versus the Mad Queen. Tyrion wants Danny dead for his brother Jamie's death. He doesn't even know. 
Yeah, he, they're both dead. Oh, he's gonna figure it out. Yeah. Well, I mean, yeah. How? If they're like buried under rubble. He's gonna just find the hand. Yeah, he's probably. Probably. Not the oh, hand. that's so what they're gonna do, and that's so fucking it's lazy. So, it's that's so what they're, they're like. Gonna he's gonna be like, like the only way Tyrion would ever be able to find out is if th- that happened, or if Dude. he travels to the the town that he told them to travel to and doesn't see them there. But yeah. but even then, he wouldn't. Or ask was, Bran. Yeah, I guess Bran would be the only one to see it. Like that's dead. so fucking stupid. You're right. They're even throwing lots. For sure, I know the writing already. It's in the hand. Oh, it's gonna be a crown in the hand. Is, is there, there even a throne together? left? Isn't the dungeon located oh underneath the throne room where Cersei and Jaime were crushed to death? Right? That's a good point. Yeah. The what? It was under like that where they were was underneath the Red Keep. Isn't the throne in the Red Keep? How is Daenerys going to be able to even see the like? Is, did the throne fall down? They probably won't even have her walk through. Uh, honestly, at this I point. mean it. It is under, but it. <clears throat> I guess it's never been specifically stated if it's directly. Yeah, under. directly or under or not. Yeah. It is under the Red Keep. Uh, what part is... Back in Season 2, uh, the Mad Queen had a vision of King's Landing in ruins, and she had another vision of her making Khal Drogo and her dead baby. A meeting, sorry. Yeah, no, no, that was, yeah, where she... Yeah, we were just talking about... Well, yeah, now we see that it was her burning the Red Keep, which had that... Yes, that's probably what's going to happen, her burning the Red Keep, but, like, not mm. the way it happened. It's it's the fact that it came out of nowhere and, yeah. the, and, like and gotta, there has been build that no character. development to even... get to the point where she would do this? Do, burning innocent kids? Over Miss Sunday? She heard bells and she started just you know, no, no, yeah. It, it wasn't even just like, like oh, we she, had she, she had one. She had one. She had one. You, everyone noticed that. Everyone saw her acknowledge she won. She looked down. I saw you. I saw me. I saw you see me. See I you. saw you see me see you win. <laughs> and now you're looking away and you're like, fuck it, I'm still gonna take them. And they just took all of. Them. And she didn't even go to the right keep. Even that's after that, that to me is even more so because it's like okay. Is it would have been kind of shitty if she still attacked having won. But the fact she didn't even go to the red keep. Yeah. And and now I'm not like, even, not even close you didn't even go the there. It wasn't like, 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 oh my people. god, Brian, you're pissing me off. <laughs> <laughs> I, just like, I swear, I can't believe you. <laughs> like, you she did this, she, Brian. No, no, like, she, eventually, Brian. she eventually got to the Red Keep like 30 minutes later. 30 minutes. Yeah. Didn't even get her. After I've beaten her. Joey to a pulp. Yeah. I'm like, <laughs> now, Brian. <laughs> he just goes over and looks Brian in the forehead. Like, now, See, Brian, I it's told your you. turn. Look at what you did, Brian. This is on your hands. Why does Danny even have Tyrion around? Like, really? He's Seriously. as useless as nipples on a breastplate. That's not true. He yes. is now. He, well, like, now. everything he's done ever since Dan stupid. and David started writing for him, like, yeah, that's Tyrion true. has not done a single it's not smart even him. thing. It's not even him. We all know that. Just as much as this isn't Danny, that's not him. That's yeah. not Tyrion. This is the dumbass writing Tyrion. This, like, is, this, D&D. Is, this, this is, is D&D. This is D&D Tyrion. Tyrion. D&D. I drink and I know things, Tyrion. The emotional, I'm going <laughs> to cry on Jamie's shoulder because I miss him and want to release him. Like, come on, Tyrion. Come on. This is so fucking... Yeah, I think we've established that prophecy means F all in this show anymore. Except for Melisandre's blue eyes prophecy. Mm-hmm, yeah. yeah. And the countries. Hmm? And, and the, the dying in the country. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And the shrouds of gold. At least John is true to his character for one thing. He can't be with Danny because they are related. He feels disgusted even though he loves her. Mm. Oh, he's probably hate jerking off. He's like, oh, no. <laughs> Not anymore. He's like, what's wrong with me? He's <laughs> crying. <laughs> Not crying anymore. Awesome. I'm just scrolling up seeing it. See if there was anything else. Yeah, there was one you missed. Uh, feel like I'm the only person who enjoyed this episode. Danny lost two dragons. She lost Jorah, lost Missandei, lost there most of her army. She's there worried about John. John is rejecting her, and she there feels unloved. She, I'm not gonna attack. She's, I'm no, not gonna attack. attack. No, hold no. on, hold on, hold on. Go ahead. My before. I make let me let me make my case. Her response to that is not attacking the person who cost her all that pain. It's attacking children. Yeah. We'll let you go over that before I say anything. Address that first. Address that. Who I'm going to let you, I'm gonna let you person, have a conversation before To that I person, it. I say, I get she has suffered great losses, but why did she point for mindless, the cannon in the completely wrong direction? Oh, there's mindless, also a question innocence. for Joey on there. Wait. Uh, oh, this question for Joey. Prophecy. At least John is true heir. Da, 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 da. There must be some scenes cut from this season that explains a lot of the random BS. By the way, uh, did Joey lose like 20 pounds in four weeks? <laughs> oh, yeah, I've been losing weight. Thank you, guys. You guys have seen a lot of progression on me. I've been going up and down, weird haircuts. Hey, we all go up. <laughs> it's a long, was it been two years? 
Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah we started. Yeah, it's been that long. you guys have grown with me two years. Well, yeah, because we didn't so, do anything last this, year. But at we, least we led up to season seven. At least yeah, I didn't let you guys down. I'll say that. At least I didn't <laughs> let you guys down. We stayed here through the long night, and we're still here. Uh, also, did anyone see the flash of the wildfire? Yeah, that, I was actually uh-huh. thinking that Cersei was just kind of, once Cersei found that she lost. I thought she was just gonna be like, "Fuck it, burn it all." Like. That's right? what I, you know. I think if Cersei had like used wildfire, even though that's problematic because wildfire burns green, so you'd kind of know. But Why if that, that if that happened and that drove Danny into the full blown attack because she took out some things and then she's like, "This is what happened." Yeah, like then if that might have the wildfire had made taken more out sin. her army yeah. that was already in the and city. And then she's like looking at Tyrion like, "Once again, I could have burned this shit down, and I'm losing but people." They didn't even do that. Yeah, that could have made a little more sense, but I just where did the random white horse? Uh, also, yeah, the horse is awesome. I think that's my Wait, favorite thing. Didn't I say like let's bring in a Pegasus? Yeah, he, he did. did. He oh did. my god, did it happen? He called it. He did call it Pegasus. <laughs> he on Pegasus. We, we, we were talking to like random mythical no. creatures. We'll call back to that, and that's I just, I just think Dude, all of her emotions that. were best I for sure said Pegasus. Him and Varys, and you and the Pegasus were all born today. <laughs> The pig Fuck Varys. I didn't even think about that. So just that. I just think all her emotions were just built up, and uh, she could all she could think of was personal reasons. Plus, she's had impulses in the past, and have people have been talked nope. out of them. Nope. Nope. Yes, so she has. But again, Tyrion wasn't next to her on her dragon. The worst she, thing she's done, right? She she burned the witch alive, right? But she pointed it at the person who did it. She. She burned the masters, no, she but again, hung them. Hung, 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 them. Them. hung the masters. She had them crucified. Which was the same thing. But it did. was a mistake because she didn't know uh, his dar's dad was not one of the masters. Right. There's no well, way. Not one of the masters that crucified. The slaves. Not one of the masters exactly. that crucified slaves. Exactly. But he is still technically she, one of the nobles she, in the town. She burned the the, the, the burned the child. She also she burned the people in the in the tomb with uh in the catacombs where the dragons were chained. Uh oh, the, yeah. which masters were those? Uh oh, yeah, she did. Yeah, she was that. burning them one by one because she was trying to get sons and her. But again, you're talking about people who were in power yeah. and she was pointing at specifically she was like was someone there. here Even knows about the sons Even of the harpy. Crazy, right? Now, I'm not saying that's not bad. But that's a whole big, big leap from burning chill, screaming children and mothers Running and babies and old people. Who had nothing to do with this Who fight. had nothing to do with the fight. Who have no power in the fight. Who had no stakes them. in the fight. That would right. have done that's that. a, I, I think, I think their, their entire justification for this is the fact that Varys made the call back to every time a Targaryen's born, they yeah. flip a coin. And they're like, and she's like crazy. ah, see? She's crazy. crazy. Yeah. Shame. 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 Mm-hmm. Ding, ding. That should be the name of this episode. Also, I mean, she okay. went from Misa to. All right. Where yeah, did the swear. random white horse come from? Oh yeah, people already talked about that. Oh geez. Ah, we've we're starting to get behind because. All uh, right. Uh, also, the way that Taisha was uh, casually dismissed last episode when it was such a huge part of the relationship in the books makes my blood boil. Who's Taisha? Taisha. Taisha. Dismissed? Tormund? Mm, ghost? <laughs> Taisha. Uh, Kit Harrington even warned us way back that season 8 was going to be trash. We Is he talking it. about his wife? Tyrion's wife? <laughs> Hashtag Tyrion's. Joey for the throne. I agree. <laughs> what the hell? Justin. I agree! Justin for the throne. <laughs> Say what? I don't agree. <laughs> You you uh, when you became a knight you uh, for oh, yeah, you did. forsake oh. all of your but he didn't, say, he didn't even say you did oh wait but it, but only a knight can knight a knight so neither of you can be on the throne no a king can knight a knight I'm <laughs> flanking okay <sorry. laughs> he said a king can knight a knight <laughs> you have to be the king first though. Oh, okay fine whatever I am <laughs> I'm telling you right now this is me being the king he is the most heir all right um, I think Taisha is Tyrion's wife I can't remember what her oh name yeah was. that is isn't it no it wasn't. All right, I, I will agree that the innocent children thing was uncalled for. She should have just flown to Cersei and burned the Red Keep. That's it was what Shay. Been saying. Shay was. Yeah. Well, no, no, but in the no, the, like no, the, the, the first, the first wife. person that he got uh, married to, uh, who wasn't even technically a horror in the books, but they made her a horror in the show. Wow. I don't know. I don't know. Um, all right, I won't even be surprised if Euron is back next episode. Yeah, Tysha, also, Tysha why, was why did, I fact checked it. Yep. Why did That's they never address that? The fact that Tyrion revealed the child cannot be his. 
Like, that's the only reason why I would think that Euron would attack Jamie is because he's jealous that the baby was yeah. Cersei's and not Jamie's. He didn't even know that. Yeah. He didn't even know that. No, but he should have known from last episode when Tyrion was like, if not maybe, for me, maybe, then for your maybe baby. Maybe they cut out that Euron scene. was right next to her. Maybe Euron's they cut out idiot. that scene of them arguing about but it. But then again, but he didn't even bring it up while he was fighting. Yeah, I know. True. That's the thing. Like, And I thought Jamie Euron was going to come back Jamie. to, actually, it's my baby. And then they'd like duel yeah. or whatever. I put a baby inside her. And he's like, and he's like no, mine it's mine. Literally two lines of dialogue. Right? And an infinitely Their better fight scene. Their fight made zero sense. Uh, burned all those people because she thinks she needs to rule in fear and can't hold the love and loyalty of the people, as John and Sansa. What and people? Showed. She burned them. That's all. not an excuse. I mean, I can see that as a motive, but that's not an excuse. Like, like this is like the that. only way I'm going to be able to keep the throne is through fear. But that's still a tyrant. Like that's still a bad yeah. person. I was still I mean, the throne. she w- she didn't have to burn innocent kids. She could have burned the to establish first. fear. She could have burned down the Red Keep and, and done that. Fire. Yeah. Yeah, I swear. And then I'm still not. I'm still not buying that. Family. Like, yeah. no, I like agree. that. If I everyone's agree. scared of her and her dragon, then no one will rebel. People uh, are scared of it, anyways. There like, are no people what? left to rebel. Yeah, what what army is gonna rebel against her at this point? What people is she gonna rule over? She killed everybody. What how, do you, can we just talk about how OP the fucking ballasters were, and then how quickly she just mounted them like they were nothing? Yeah. Like they couldn't even turn suddenly, but they were whipping the like. Oh, because she knew them. they were there this yeah, time. Yeah, this time she was just surprised. See, she didn't even I was, try to burn them. The first I, I was she saying like this, her other dragon. I, got I was saying by. during the episode she should have attacked at night just with her yeah. dragon. Get rid of the ballistas that way. Yeah, and it's just like that would have made a lot of sense. But like you build up these amazing killing machines, and she just like zips through an entire fleet. <laughs> not doesn't even doesn't get, get one get little hit. man because they're uh, for convenience. Yeah, yeah. And then once they weren't convenient anymore to the storytelling, they m- removed them. Yeah. So, but I'm saying, Crazy. remove them at night. Like, yeah. you can't, like, if if she flies really, really high up, nobody's going to be able to spot Drogon. Then just, like, nosedive, burn all the ballistas, in a and then come back the next day with your army. Yeah. Like, or even attack at dawn. Like, attack in the morning. Like, when nobody can even prepare. Like, go, that would, but, you know. Any strategy. Can we get an ounce of strategy? Can we get an <laughs> yeah. ounce of strategy? Made more sense than What do you think? What do you guys think George R. R. Martin? Yeah, will, yeah. Uh, yeah. All right, from Justin K. What do you guys think uh, George R. R. Martin will mean by a bittersweet ending? Because after tonight's episode, I don't, see, I don't see sweet anymore. I think he meant bittersweet, like it's still Game of Thrones, but it's bitter because it's going to be trash. <laughs> He's like, it's going to be ass, but I think it ends. that is a convenient way to possibly. I'm not saying he is to possibly hide discontent because he could say bittersweet in the sense of, oh, it's sad, it's ending, but you know, That's we had true. a great run. Or it could be bittersweet in the sense of, like, it's ending and this is kind of I feel shitty. like the show writer, like, he gave them very small bullet points and the show writers completely went off the rails. The Starks, the family that you started with, they're still doing fine and have the North. Aw, oh, sweet. Everything else sucks. Maybe. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy, too. Um, because there's... Okay. There's no distinction between being beloved and being genocidal. Why would, why also, why not rule like Tywin Lannister did if she realized that she wouldn't be loved? Sansa for the throne. Uh, also, Tysha Sansa Tyrion, is like a no threat. Like, they're all the way in King's Landing. One episode, they're going to travel somehow. Oh, we're way up past one. I know. Uh, what will happen to Drogon right? after seeing the destruction of the dragons are capable of, capable of doing? Will he survive or will he die? I think all magic's going to be gone from the land. I think the dragon will. Um, it should have already been if it was gonna. Like I don't know why now suddenly the yeah. dragon would die. You know the show is bad if the actors themselves are even saying it's going to be bad. They said that. Uh, I think so, like there there was yeah there was some videos that you can see of actors being like like t- Peter Dinklage like very sarcastically was like oh yeah Dan and Dave are the best writers in the show. Uh, so I want to get a clip of it's that. It's gonna be a great season. Like, right? Oh yeah, I want to see that. Too. I gotta get that clip. That's yeah. awesome. Uh, so there. Thank yeah. you, and, and Thank I think, you, Peter. Uh, Thanks, Peter. When when Kit Harrington was asked about the ending, he was just like, he's like, if you had one word for the ending, he's like, disappointing. He said that. He said that. <laughs> Kit Harrington. Kit Harrington. And, 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 and then they're like, disappointing. Why? He's like, oh, sad. <laughs> like he, he he kind of wow. shifted. Like he's like, like disappointed. See, it's like a right work. behind. Wow. Uh-oh. See, like, why would you use the word disappointing? Arya added a new name Why would to that list? word come to I mind? I love that there are still people saying that after the White Walkers got killed early, they're like, no, this is how the show should have been going, and this is all along the plot. And it's always been about the throne. It's always been about... And then this happens. They're probably like... Sansa sitting in Winterfell being like, I told you so. Yeah. 
Sansa's done. Why would Sansa even come back into play? Like, are they gonna like march their entire army back in one episode? Sansa is my queen, bro. I'm bending the knee to Sansa at this point. I am not bending the knee to John. Swear. Not at all. I pick Sansa over John. John is an idiot. idiot. He has proven time and time again he knows nothing. I take Sansa. Literally, he is Sansa and Bran is hand to the king. You think dying would have taught him something? He knows. He can see everything ahead of time. That would be a pow- that would be a powerful. Uh, so I guess Dan Daenerys is the green eye. Uh, does Danny have green eyes? Does I don't know. I think she has blue eyes. Oh, it's blue. Yeah, um, I think they are blue. Freaking Sansa, she's part of the reason Danny burnt turned into the Mad Queen. Nah. Blaming Sansa for Danny turning into uh, the Mad Queen. Ah, yeah. I'm not That's gonna. I'm, I'm not gonna say that. That's no. a stretch. There is no that, way, Gabriel. I am not going to spoil it, but I read some leaks for next episode, and they have completely given up the logical progression of the story. Nice. Well, yeah, that happened a that. while ago. Yeah. Not surprised <laughs> there. So what happened to the pinpoint accuracy of the Iron Fleet? They could take down yeah. all. Yeah, that's what I was saying earlier. Can't land a single hit. Pinpoint Power. accuracy of a bigger dragon yeah. at that. Power level swing to the convenience of the plot. Yep. Yeah. As soon as it became, like I said, as soon as, as soon as they became inconvenient, and that's what they've been doing for two years now. And see, everybody's new to this train. Two years they've been doing this. Anything that got inconvenient, they're just like, get Gone. rid of it. Gone. Gone. Yeah. This is so disappointing. We're in the end game now. <laughs> in the end game, apparently, is... The the dark elf from Thor two that no one liked instead of Thanos. <laughs> the books are gonna the book sales are and then, the roof. And then halfway through yeah. the movie it will switch and the end game will be. I, I, I hope that George R. R. Martin announces Winds of Winter tomorrow. Tomorrow. Imagine <laughs> he's like, I, gotta, I gotta recover. George R. R. Martin's like, like, you know what? I'm not gonna watch Sunday because I need to start writing. He, he, he's yeah. just like plot twist. Both of the books are already done. I'm releasing. But you know what? Back to this back. is good yeah. because <laughs> if George R. R. Martin did on a off chance co-sign this shit and it's relatively close to what he's gonna do this will give him time to be like you know what maybe I should make some changes yeah if this is what he thought <laughs> no but he did uh, say in an interview that he wouldn't do that even yeah. if like because That's you true. gotta like if you've been actually planting the the seeds well enough but no, I'm fine if if Daenerys ends up going mad books wise I'm fine yeah. But I don't want it to be done Not as lazy quick. as this was. Uh, lazy. I, it won't be, I don't think. So, like, I feel like if he is doing it lazy, you've got time to fix it, bro. At yeah. this point, I'm willing to wait. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> fix it. Don't do this. It's all too oh, you're right, right, yeah, Danny's meant to have violet eyes, but Emilia and Clark are right, blue eyes. Right, she could... Yeah, yeah, yeah oh, she was having right, issues with right. contact lenses or something like yeah, that. Yeah, that's right. right. Um... All right, so for those who make the excuse, uh, that excuse, have people forgotten that the series first began with the White Walkers being introduced first before the main cast? Thank you. No. Thanks. You're my people. We, we already passed that, that when, yeah, when Jamie left King's Landing, it started snowing, but this episode, no snow, big time jump next episode. How about that long night being like... A night. Yeah, half yeah. a night. Half a, half night. a night. Half a night. Long night, and the long winter is over. Half a night, so she got crushed by rocks. <laughs> and the longest the longest summer they had had only one day of winter. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. usually usually long yeah. summers are followed by, like, terrible winters, and it's just like, Even oh. longer winters, they say. Yeah. Even longer winters. Yeah. We had a long summer that's as old as Bran, at when least. J- yeah. When Jamie left. Oh, no, at least as old as Arya. Arya's never seen winter either. No. No, no snow in King's Landing. Da- Danny is okay. Uh, they could have given the dragon some armor or something. Nope, insane fast speed and dodging powers required overnight. Uh, acquired overnight. Explanation, Euron had aimbot, which was patched with the last update. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. Is it uh, bad that after Cersei killed Masande, I felt bad for her in the end, even after everything she's done? No. Uh, I see how that... I'm curious to see what the fucking inside the episode has to say. Scorpions just entirely gave up trying to shoot uh, her when she was burning them up. They weren't even moving at all. There's tons. Uh, there's vids of Tyrion, Danny, and John being asked their opinion about the ending. They've all indicated their disappointment. HBO apparently offered Dan and Dave a budget for ten seasons to end the show, yeah. and they refused, saying that, that was they bad couldn't do on it. Their part. <laughs> They're like, I'm sorry. To end the show. Uh, also, Amelia and Melisandre's actress were at. John, uh, Justin, do you know Melisandre's actress? No, Miss Sande is Miss Sande. Sorry, Miss Sande's actress. N- Nathaniel, uh, N- Natalie Emmanuel. What about her? Yeah. Okay. So this person just said Miss Sande's actress. I'm like, Justin knows. 
Uh, also, Amelia and Masande's actress were asked about it, and they replied with such snark and sarcasm, like, "Oh yeah, it's great." Wow, <laughs> wow, that's sad. That's sad how they how they what they could do. Trashed was. it. Yeah. That's why they're gonna have their phones I think off the best, so they don't I think they the best the single hate. comment to that I've heard is somebody said these guys watched the end of Dexter and said, "Oh, you thought that was bad? Hold my beer." <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, shit, they were almost gonna Dexter fucking Sir Sam Jamie. <laughs> uh, let's, just, let's just go be lumberjacks. Sir <laughs> <laughs> Sam Jamie, let's that's just go true. be lumberjacks. That's true. <laughs> But they subverted the expectation. It didn't happen. Oh my god! Twist. Oh my god! Twist. 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 Somewhere, somewhere, <laughs> some poor diehard Dexter fan who hated that ending was like, "No, no, not lumberjacks again. We are Jamie's not lumberjacking again. Jamie's gonna be a lumberjack." <laughs> wow, dude, the hound was a lumberjack. <laughs> he was. What is with these guys and lumberjacks, man? Oh Why is that god. the move? Wait, did they? Are they the ones that did? No. No. Oh, okay. God. Uh, no, no, no. But they saw that and they were like, we love that. <laughs> Twist. I just want to ask them, like, did you guys like the Into Dexter? And they'd be like, loved it. I'm sure <laughs> their favorite director is M. Night Shyamalan. M. Night Shyamalan. Yeah. We took a lot of, a lot of points from his. Uh, we took inspiration right. from M. Night Shyamalan. Yeah. You're on bought. The guys who wrote How I Met Your Mother. Yeah. You're on bought the Plot Armor DLC and then got a refund when uh, Swimming to Sea. You're on somehow running into Jamie and surviving the Dragon Blast to a ship. Uh, what were they even thinking? None of this even makes sense. Yep, yeah, yeah, that's what we've been saying. Uh, in the immortal words of Catelyn Stark, Enough! Please let it end! <laughs> Yeah, only one more episode oh. left, guys. It was, Dude, I wish. I wish. What if like that Walder Frey play? is still alive? <laughs> like, bring it. I don't even care. Seriously, he sits on the throne. They're got. Yeah, they're, you know, they're the probably phrase. like the last thing is like Jack and Hagar pulling off, being like, "I was serial for real the whole time." <laughs> <laughs> it's just Arya pulling off everyone's face, like, <laughs> like oh my god, Including just, just like all, get all the fan Hagar. services out of the way that they can. They're like, "All right, we got Kalibol. the last episode is just yeah, like, it's like just, we we got uh, Arya and Gendry, uh, Arya and Gendry having sex. We got the Kalibol. bowl. Oh, oh, I got it. Cereal Pharrell is Jack and Hagar. Yeah. <laughs> that's my, that's the other one they were wanting. Yeah, this is so bad. Oh. Congratulations. Congratulations. And now, don't Dan and Dave have the next three episode, uh, episodes of Star Wars? They're doing no. their own trilogy. Yeah, they're doing their own trilogy for Star Wars. Mm-hmm. That needs to get ripped from them. Yeah. Immediately, they need to get revoked. They need to get fired. I they have a work. feeling. Dude, it's possible, because this happened with How I Met Your Mother. Uh, they were supposed to do a How, How I Met Your Dad spinoff, but the finale was so bad it killed it. Do you think some of the spinoffs for Game of Thrones might... No, I think some of their Star Wars thing, they might reevaluate that and be like, ooh, if people hate these guys. Right. Yeah. It might kill the spinoff. It might kill their spinoff. Then yeah. control it. Disney might be like, you know what? Actually, maybe. <laughs> Apparently, yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll get in contact with you about when to start that. We don't know if we're going to do it. We're going to do it anymore. I, we might not do it. Apparently, well, they do people even still like guys, Star Wars. <laughs> Apparently they filmed multiple endings. Hopefully we get a DVD with a Choose Your Ending Season 8. That can we get a that. Choose Your Ending Season 5? Choose Your Scare. 5 through 8? Yeah. Can we get a Choose Your Season ending? Uh, Surely Lost is the better comparison. Yeah. Uh, Brienne's actress was pretty angry, and Nikolai, Jamie, tried to be polite about it, but he did say he was not that happy. They both said that the good part was the surprise factor, though. That's the best thing they can give these dumbass writers. Their favorite director is Ryan Johnson. That's much better. <laughs> <laughs> I know I was waiting for a last Jedi to come in there. <laughs> Wish I had a time machine so I could warn R.R. Martin not to not abandon the show and write his books quicker. Yeah. Apparently it's going to be a uh, Knights of the Old Republic trilogy. Oh. Like it, it said Kotar, which I usually think of Knights of the Round, but I think Knights of the, Knights of the Old Republic. Republic. Yeah, Knights yeah. of the Old Republic. Um, uh, watch. That's how they will end John's arc. Wait, what is how they will end John's arc? Lost. John will go north to be a lumberjack. <laughs> 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 I'm, at this point, yes. I'm in on it. I'm in for it with ghosts. Go- and yeah. torment. And torment. <laughs> ghost, you just see torment with, a, with a hunk of logs. He just smarts like. <sighs> 
The love story is complete. And then, and then a yellow is. umbrella falls. There it is. <laughs> like, they just got to get all of the worst endings and then just put it into one. Just put, just it put one. make Make John a lumberjack, have someone with, like, a yellow umbrella marry Arya or something. <laughs> <laughs> I, I've never seen Lost. So I don't know what. what no, oh, yeah. no, no, yeah, I, I'm, I'm. It's how I met your mother. I know the yellow one, but what's Lost? How, everybody hates that one. Yeah. Uh, I, I never watched. The thing is, I haven't seen Lost, but I think I know the ending. But I don't. They're all dead. Yeah, yeah. Dead. it was purgatory. Yeah, which is retarded because I watched the first two seasons and it was amazing. Stopped watching, thank God, and it got horrible. Yeah, horrible. They're all dead. Well, spoiler alert. Thanks, Joey. Oh yeah, sorry. There, there might have been <laughs> people in the no, live stream. For, I know. We're Somebody's like, stream. I'm literally loading the last episode right now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Be like, all right, <laughs> gonna finish Game of Thrones, and I'm gonna watch this last episode of Lost. <laughs> Catch a little bit of board watch, and then it's Lost time. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I, I don't know if there's really much more to say yeah. uh, as far as this episode's concerned. We will. I well, have zero I, predictions I, for next I, episode. I don't, I don't know about. At this point, I give up. Yeah. I don't know about Justin because he might be at Disneyland like next week or I don't know just, we're but. all going to give Justin a longing look and this is going to be the end of Justin for you guys <laughs> and he'll just walk oh, away into the woods. I can't miss the finale yeah, you guys gotta for go. the world I've got to come at this yeah. it's so bad <laughs> I have to be here we won't let you guys oh, down Bran will become a magical dog and John, John's sidekick <laughs> oh my god Hound randomly turns Drinks up a lot. Drinks the scum villainy after the season. Carrying Lost is going to be lumberjack to go back trash. to life. All right, yep. so yeah, I think I think we should probably end it now because yeah. otherwise we're just going to talk in circles and circles and circles and. <sighs> oh man. Yeah. What a sad, sad. All right. Episode. Well, I liked it. <laughs> <laughs> the writings have got me. The writing was just. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, Valar Ulysses. Uh, <laughs>